Hey what's up guys and welcome back to a brand new video on my channel today. Today guys we have episode number 4 of the Road to Glory on FIFA 19 Ultimate Team. Now as you can see from the last episode the coin total has gone up but that has gone down from what we um, from what we had. Um, as you can see I sold PK on, PK on for 26k. Um, also sold on a couple of these gold players and bronze players and the bronze manager actually sold for 600 coins which is really good. So yeah, I decided to keep Carver Howe because I will show you guys just in a second after I show you uh, what's left that we um, are going to be doing an SBC. So um, obviously these are just like the sell-ons from like the packs that we did open in the last episode. Um, um, I went up to like maybe like 30 odd K but obviously I've gone down a bit because I'm about to do an SBC. Now if you do go to, on to enjoy the video then please leave a like. Comment your thoughts and stuff you want me to do on within the series, teams, SBCs and stuff like that. Um, that'd be greatly appreciated. And also subscribe if you are new around here. Now, as you can see here, the Swedish Player of the Year is what we're going to be doing. As you can see here, now obviously I'm using the Carver Hell that I had. Um, obviously, Casillas picked him up for 1.1k, very cheap. Um, go the other way. Carver Hell, first owner. Nacho Fernandez was 2.7k. Jardel, I know he's in the squad, um, but I got him for obviously I already had him for 1.3. I'm just going to buy him back and um, use him in the squad uh, that we obviously um, have already got. Adriano, he was um, quite expensive, uh, Brazilian left back, uh, 2.2k. Um, Trigoas or Trigoas, um, 2k. Illeramendi was the most expensive at 5.8k because he was a, he's an 84 rated, and I guess he's good for SBCs. Uh, Turan for 615, Lucas Vasquez for 1600. The Swedish guy that you need, uh, he was a first owner in the club. And this Champions League card, Gary Rodriguez, I'm never going to use him. I may as well just use him in an SBC. Um, so obviously, I'm going to submit this squad and get this Paulinho um, SBC card. Now, with the second team, he's going to be starting in the second team. I'm going to, obviously, the second team, like I said, is going to be for like squad battles and stuff. So he will be a starter, and I'm going to change the formation in the second team. And play like four, probably like a four-three-three attack with a Talisker at Cam, Pato at striker, and then him on the left wing. Um, I think it's a really nice little card, you know, 85 pace, 84 dribbling, 83 shooting, and his physical is not bad at 77 there. Um, we're gonna have a little quick look at his in-game stats. I'm gonna find a chemistry style to put on him. Four star, four star, medium, medium. It looks like a really good card. The only thing is, obviously, his stamina is a bit low. But like I said, I'm gonna find a nice. Um, um, I'm going to find a nice chemistry style for him. And as you can see here, guys, this is the squad at the moment. Obviously, I'm going to sell on, most likely, sell on like all the tradable players that won't be in the squad. So, uh, yeah. Um, once I get um, so, sold on the squad, upgrade the team, I'll be right back. And I'll show you through the squad, the new players we picked up, and the formation and stuff we're going to be going with um, for the second team. Right, guys, I am back. And as you can see, the squad has changed a lot um, this is obviously the second team but it, it, in a way it does look better than the first team uh, when you look at it and um, so obviously we've changed formation to 4-3-3-4 four, three, three, um, four. so what we've done is signed oh, Kepa 1.1k um, you know 6 foot 2 84 diving 84 reflexes I think he's a decent keeper I've used him on my main account he's all right you know for 1.1k you can't really complain um, if we go this way, Lala, everyone uses him, but obviously his inform cards, um, which we don't have enough coins for. Um, very cheap for 600 coins. It looks like a solid right back. Um, very happy with him. I think Rudiger's price for 900 coins is a steal, because I think he's really, really good in the game. Him and David Luiz at the back together are really good on my main account. I've used those two for ages, and I just think they're great. Um, obviously, we've got the same left back. Picked up Rabia for 2.8k. Uh, high medium work rates. He's got well all-rounded stats. I think he's going to be a great card for us. Um, obviously, Fernando and Talisca is still the same. Uh, sent Maximin, uh, Maxi, uh, Min, uh, picked him up for 1k, 4 star, 4 star. 91 pace is going to be really good for us. And the dribbling as well. Uh, I'm looking forward to using him. Pato's obviously there. And obviously, the new boy, uh, Paulinho. Uh, I put on a. Uh, what chem style was it? A finisher chem style. Um, so if we go over here and look. Plus 10 jumping, plus 10 aggression, plus 5 strength, and then his shot power, attacking position, finishing, long shots, volleys, and penalties all get bumped up as well. So that is the squad battles team in a sense. Um, 
whichever teams play whichever team plays better then I'll probably use um in terms of the Premier League side which we have now upgraded a lot as well um, we picked up Pickford for um, 1,200 coins. Uh, I think Pickford is a great card. 88 kick in, 83 dive, and 86 reflex is really handy for us. Um, I decided to keep Yedlin instead of selling him on from the second team and put him in the first team. So Joe Gomez does like, exit the squad. Um, he did. Joe, Joe Gomez was all right, but I prefer Yedlin, who's uh, a bit better than uh, Joe Gomez. Eric Bai for 1.6k. Obviously, he was like the big centre back go to OP player so I'm excited to use him replace him for Ben Mee obviously Stones is still there but he's got two games left I think I'm just gonna buy Stones as normal card once this runs out and um, picked up Ben Davies for 1000 coins high high work rates and um, obviously Christian Fuchs wasn't great and um, so I kind of just decided to swap him out straight away Delafay is still there uh, Adrian Silva is still there Son's still there, two games left, so unfortunately I won't have enough coins to pick up Song because obviously he's an 84 rated and he's quite good. So I don't know what I'll be able to do in terms of a left mid in the Prem. Uh, I'm not too sure at the moment. Then we've also kept Lingard and Sigerson, and we've also put Josh King up top, you know. Um, Sturridge was decent, but I just wanted a bit of pace uh, up top. And I, I think Josh King is one of the best players for it. And their weekly objectives, uh, I need to score like... Uh, three goals of a Norwegian player to get the Norwegian player of the month so I'm just doing it to kind of do this uh, in a sense where I can get the goals and then get that player of the month card just to have in the club and maybe use for future SBC so that is the team those are the teams that we're running with at the moment uh, four episodes in I'm really really happy with that and um, hopefully you guys seem to like those teams let me know down below in the comment section uh, I'm gonna move on into actually before I do Obviously, our coin balance has gone right down to the bottom. Uh, I'll just show you that this Romeo sold. And I've obviously got a few players uh, listed up as well who obviously have left the club um, in terms of uh, not getting played. So, what I want to quickly show you, obviously, my division, division rivals, I still need to um, get my placement matches done. I just haven't really got the time to do it yet. Then eventually we can get into foot champs. Uh, at the moment, squad battles, I've only played four games, I think. And I'm still in gold free which is decent uh, I can play these ones and then update as well um, so yeah it's not we're doing all right we're doing all right um, so yeah at the moment gold free a prime mixed players pack a jumbo premium gold pack 10k and a kit so I mean I'm very happy with that gold one is decent as well and then elite if we can get up to there it's great um, which I think we can if we have if, if I'm able to play all the games and I think I can um, in terms of SBC's um, I don't think I'll be doing, I, I love to do this card, but it's, I'm never going to be able to get enough coins. Uh, also, I've obviously got the advanced ones to do, which I will do eventually. So that's a little basic of the area we're at right now. Uh, I'm going to jump into some games and stuff and do some challenges and I'll, uh, I'll be back in a... Right guys, here we are with our squad battle rewards. Now, this section is actually from a, I think... A a week or two ago obviously <clears throat> I haven't really been uploading the road to glory much because I haven't really had time to play the games or play on the road to glory at all um, so I'm sorry for that but this part is like so obviously the two things that I recorded this episode were a few weeks ago this for, uh, squad battles rewards is from like the week after you've seen those two things so yeah it's pretty messed up but anyway I'm gonna jump into the packs <clears throat> I am um, I haven't played squad battle, <clears throat> squad battle since I actually um, did these rewards as we get past story there. Now, it's actually not a bad card to get. He's 82 rated. We could easily use him in an SBC or something like that. Uh, we get a few players in, in this pack as well. We're going to sort out um, prices and stuff like that because um, player prices right now, they're a bit different compared to what they were maybe uh, two weeks ago. Um, like non-rare gold to sell them for a lot. Um, it just depends on the league and the position and obviously the rating. But... Other than that, this pack wasn't that great, to be honest. I also um, just want to quickly say, obviously, I'm talking and recording my voice um, ahead of, like, episodes. So, I think I've got two more episodes already recorded. So, the stuff that you're going to see is a bit outdated by, like, a week or two. Um, but I just haven't had the time to upload and edit uh, everything out. So, I do apologise for that. Um, obviously, you know, I'm a career mode based channel, most people just watch my career mode videos, but there are like, there is a, a there's at least 40 odd people that do like to watch my ultimate team videos, um, which is, it's better than, better than zero, eh, so, 
Um, I obviously I want to upload this content, so I'm going to upload it because I I do enjoy playing Ultimate Team. Um, so I will upload this, um, not as much as career mode, obviously career mode is going to be the main focus for the channel, um, but like I said, I, I like playing Ultimate Team, I like doing the Road to Glory, uh, so I will continue to upload it, just not as regularly as probably people would want. So for the next, this episode and then I think one more, I think I've got some outdated stuff, um, but I will check on the videos and I'll probably hopefully get those these videos out this week, um, so this is the week of the 17th to uh, the 21st I do believe so um, I should be able to get everything out before uh, the end of this week in terms of the stuff that I've already got saved up so then we can start trying to get into some foot champs because obviously I haven't had the time to qualify for the first um, foot champs um, so yeah that's uh, another issue which I have faced but moving on we uh, didn't really get another good pack there um, Vida the centre back uh, I just listed him up uh, same with all um, same with the other rare player that I had uh, I'm pretty sure I list up like every gold player, but then my trade tra <laughs> my transfer list does get full, so I have to send everything to the club which I want to keep. Um, so I had a little look, uh, put everything in the discard pile, and kept the stuff that I want to keep. Basically, the players' contracts and fitness cards. That is that's all I wanted to keep. And uh, yeah, that's about it. <clears throat> discard of the rest, and we move on into the final pack of my squad battle rewards not very happy in terms of the rewards we actually got back from getting like gold one i think i did get um again nothing good here we get a center back who is called raul why is it not the icon raul i will never know anyway a couple of rares got milner in there as well we've got shoof uh the right mid from Schalke. Uh, apart from that saved everything to the club not really great um i also wanted to show you guys um, the upgrades that I made from the team which I do and I showed you the stuff that I sold on from other various packs and SBCs that I did um, do in the previous episode I do believe that free hunter card we did get from the daily objective sold for 5k which is amazing um, so obviously I've got all these players selling hopefully I can get uh, a bit a few more coins from that here's the squads um, I have improved a little bit from the last time you've seen them I'm pretty sure um, Pickford's in there, Bailly's in there, uh, I got rid of Stones as loan card now, uh, Felipe Anderson's in there now as well, so yeah the squad is looking decent, uh, also I think I upgraded a couple of players on the other squads, um, so yeah it, the team is looking decent, it is looking decent, we got that player of the year card as well, uh, Hansen, uh, who was in the like, I don't know, uh, like daily, weekly objective, so I got him just as another card to have in the club. And yeah guys, this is going to be the end of the episode, as you will see the team changes that I made, Pato's in there, Alan's in there, no sorry, Alan's the new addition, anyway, I'm out, peace!